So the adventure started as we got on a plane headed to Los Cabos in Mexico. When we arrived, we got an Uber and eventually arrived at the resort. And let's just say, it looks epic. decided that we wanted to go up a mountain. So I just went to the top of the building and look at this view. So this is the mountain that we eventually climbed later that day. It was pretty hot and we had a guide with a lot of dogs. But it was a good hike and the view at the end was unbelievable. After staying up there for about 20 minutes, we made our way back down and then we saw some animals. There were a lot of seagulls and the caves looked very epic. After having some food and checking out these cool parrots, we played some mini golf. We're just playing some golf, watch this. The golf course was pretty nice, and the next day I just watched the beautiful waves. All you can do is just watch the waves. Later that day, we went to another restaurant and we walked through the city and then played some ping pong. After a cool little sunset, we played some bocce and the next morning, we woke up to a beautiful sunrise again. We decided that we wanted to get some food, so we went to the supermarket. We went to the supermarket to get oats, bread, and fruits because the restaurants take a lot of time and money. One time we went to get street food and there was an annoying fly that stole the oily food and escaped because there were no doors. Then it flew and a dolphin ate it. We then wanted to go spend some time with the dolphins, so we became a trainer for a day. We washed some fish bins and visited a tiny dolphin baby. Then it was time to get out of the pool and into the classroom. The only thing I remember is that baby dolphins have whiskers. Then we had a photo shoot and we got to do an underwater swim, which was very cool. When we got back, there was a Mexican fiesta. There was a guy called Roberto. He was a funny showman. Tequila! Speaking of tequila, there were daily challenges to win a bottle. I won one by making a paper plane that flew the furthest. Anyway, let's cut out of this cartoon and back to the resort. The resort was very nice and peaceful and we played a lot of ping pong and cornhole. I explored the resort and it was pretty big. There were some funny turtles and we had a nice room where we slept. Oh. 
The next morning we walked into the city again. These are crazy waves. Now we'll just have to like make it down through there. We went to a cool beach. Then I got the drone up in the air and I got some pretty cool footage. The arc was very amazing. The next morning, we went on another hike and we saw some pelicans or whatever they were and a lot of seagulls. We just enjoyed the beach and we walked along the shore. The next day, we just spent at the resort watching the waves and flying the drone. The waves are bigger than they look. Then we went to check out some street food and enjoyed the walk home and then an epic sunset greeted us as we got back to the resort from the street food. Look at that sunset. Some fireworks later, we rented a car and traveled to a place called La Paz. It was pretty epic and the scenery was way different than to what I am used to. The water had a beautiful color and there were a lot of fish. So these rocks are actually very sketchy. As you can see, they're straight above me. I'm just walking here and like, there's literally just these big rocks here just sticking out. So let's get out of here. Then we made it back to the resort. It was about a two hour drive. And then on our last day, we decided to check out another place which had a really epic beach and some good snorkeling. The snorkeling was actually very cool and it was a lot better than I expected. So then we returned the car made it back to the resort and spent the last couple hours before we had to leave. The ocean is very nice. Well, tomorrow we're packing up and then going on the plane. Then we'll be home and then it's time for another adventure. So see you in the next adventure. So then we made it to the airport hopped into the plane and safely made it home. I hope to see you in the next adventure.